He went in our house and he got his older brother's pistol. It was a 22 pistol. It was a defective gun. And with his 14 year old mind, he didn't think it worked. And he was showing his friends it didn't work. He pulled the trigger and it didn't go off. So he pulled the trigger again and it didn't go off. And he was telling them that, see, it don't work. So then he put it to his head and it went off. When I was asked to donate, I was very angry. I thought they were crazy. So I went home and I sat in the recliner that he always sat in. And uh, he come to me and he said, Mama, what would I do? This is not about you. What would I do? And I got on the phone and I told him I would because that's who Kaylin was. It was very scary, <laughs> very. Uh, um, but very exciting. Um, I felt like I, I knew Joe. Just went through life, I wasn't able to do things that everybody else my age was doing. And uh, the older I got, it just seemed I was dragging a little bit more, dragging a little bit more. And then I started having heart attacks and and they, after a while, they figured out what the problem was. I got the transplant. They told me very little. Uh, it was a, they told me he was a very young man. From day one, all I could think about was the young man. That's all I could think about. As soon as you open my wallet, this is the first thing. That was his last school picture. So meeting him, it was a... Uh, it was a must. It was something that it, it had to be done. And I, I'm, I'm glad we did it. And I heard my baby's heartbeat. I can hear it. Can you? If he knew he could save a life, he would do it. No questions asked. I think we made a great decision. I think Kalen is looking down on me and he's, he's proud of what his mama did. He's proud that his mama knew who he was. I know Kalen is with me and I know Kalen is with Joe. And I just want to tell everybody that uh, this could happen to you. Um, everyone needs to donate. You, need, you never know if your child or you might need help from a total stranger. Uh, you just never know. Uh, but it is the right thing to do. I'm thankful Joe has a, a second chance. And I'm just, I think everybody needs to consider being an organ donor.